channel. <laughs> what can you guys spoil about the next season? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we got it. Oh, can't, can't say that. Oh, oh, yeah. I'm going to tell him. I'm going to tell him. Okay. Tell him. 13 episodes! Guaranteed! <laughs> 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 That's some yeah. Yeah. You know, if you were wondering if it was 9, if you were wondering if it was 5, <laughs> 13, I'm going to spoil it all. 13, big one. And will there ever be a time that your character's kids have a play date? Ooh, that's a great yeah. idea. Wait a minute. No, we're pitching that right now. I love I'm it. I'm that. I'm you can do the whole thing at Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> that's a good idea. A, yeah, well, we, we did have an episode where we were competitive. I mean, we have a lot of episodes where we're kind of competitive about things, but, you know, when we were trying to do the best thing, yeah. 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 Oh, it would have been nice to end that with a play date. Yeah, but, you know, we have one of our actors, I mean, I have twins, uh, actresses, and but one who loves it and one is like, I gotta go home. <laughs> and, <laughs> and you know what? I, hopefully, I, I want her to renegotiate. I want her to renegotiate yeah. her deal. Yeah. Because she's not happy. She's like, hey, you know what? I've been here how long? And I'm like, oh, okay, just a little longer, please. Well, the other one's like, yeah, let's do another one. Let's do another one. So that play day is going to have to work around their schedule. Around the schedule. Yeah, you know, yeah they, exactly. And their kids. They, well, to Antonio Corbo, who plays Nicolaj, um, or Nicolaj. Uh, is is a, a passionate <laughs> professional, uh, and uh, he is. He's he's a dynamite kid. Oh, well, you're uh, already so. one-upping him. I no, <laughs> no, I mean, I, 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 no, I know. I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute. My kids are smart too. Maybe some episode. We'll have to fix that. <laughs> um, Terry, I had a question for you. So last season with Terry and season four with Holt as well, we saw team members going for like promotions. And as the audience, we like, we want to root for them. We want them to progress in their career. But also, we don't want the squad to break up. And I wondered if like you guys go for the same thing as an actor, how you kind of work through that in your head of like, I want my character to be promoted, but also I don't want to leave the 9 9 well, you know, one thing I love is just the fact that the world of Brooklyn Nine-Nine changes every episode. You know where you are by episode. You know what I mean? It's like that time when you, you and Chelsea had a relationship. Yeah. You're watching that, you know where you are. Yeah. When it's not there, you know, oh, that's past that. Yeah. It's like movement and, and, you know, I love the fact that Santiago going for her promotion. So when you see her in a police uniform, yeah. you know where we are. Yeah. This is life. You know what I mean? And... You know, I think in the old days, everybody just wanted to watch the same episode over and over and didn't mind. But there's too many choices. To, now TV ends. I mean, I, I mean, you gotta have a well, you have to have a show that this was our last season. Oh, it's like, oh, you know, that was unthinkable when I was a kid. Like shows never ended. Fantasy Island was going on forever. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, over and over. It that was, was, that that was, was bad. They had the same actors come back with different names. That's You're right. like, yeah, I'm we'll okay it. with that. <laughs> yeah. You know, Sam Jackson got killed like 40 times on Spencer for Hire. He was the same if you're that gonna, was okay. If you could have another, an actor you guys have worked with come back with a different name for Brooklyn, which one would you be? Oh, my God. We've, we've been lucky enough to Lynn. get so many great. You know, I would love Sean Astin again. Yeah, I mean. He'd break out of jail or something. Well, yeah, for sure. I mean, no, no, that's a whole new character. Oh, that would no, oh, no. Same, Sean same actor, a, a, new character, I, I and you don't have breath. I would, and you just, like, I'd love staring. to see uh, Bill Hader back. Mm. Oh, Bill Hader. He died, so he could come back. He come back. Yeah. yeah, he died, so he can come back. He could come back with another yeah. dude. That would be awesome. His twin brother. <laughs> <laughs> He's, he's got to he's come back with that image. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what right. I mean? He's rolling. He's That's rolling. Right. <laughs> we, we've been blessed. Is there anything in your own lives that um, you have the kind of joy and passion for um, that you have for Jake and that you have for Yoko? Wow, that's a good question. That's a great question. Um, wow. Well, I mean, a person, you know, besides my family, you know, that's an easy call, but also just a passion is is important. Uh, you know, Charles' passion for Jake. My passion for doing what I do. Uh, is is right there. I love it. I've been lucky and blessed to get this far to work with the amount of people that I have, and I don't. I can't think of anything else I want to do. So, I mean, if that's. I know it's not quite the same. It's not a person, but I relate that way. I feel like I want to grab what I do and just hug it a lot. You know, put it up on a pedestal. I want to say, you know, Terry loves yoga because it's his respite. It's his. It's like a yoga commercial. It's like, you know, he's stressed out about the people and then, and then, and then, but when he's in his yoga, oh, leave me alone. Yeah. I'm alone. It's awesome. I have those moments. 
I do. I, with I'm yogurt? A, with yogurt? Yeah. <laughs> yes, it has been with yogurt, definitely. But it's also been with kind of gym, kind of like this is me time. Yeah. It's all, he's all about self-care. And it, it totally symbolizes male self-care is his love of yoga. It's just like, it's healthy, it's mine. And like he mentioned, even, you know, the super, what is it, the his, his, his love of yogurt parfaits and the whole thing. It was like, that was an ecstasy for him. Like, don't take that away from him. You know? And that's, that's how I am.